good day, my good man, and a uh, very good day to lecturer also. We are from Lex 2012 UPM EMAC, Group 68. Today we are going to record for our group discussion 4. My name is Yap Kasi, my metric number is 187378. My name is Hasna Izeti Pazul Amri, my metric number 190410. Hi, my name is Nurul Suhaila, my metric number is 179388. My metric number is 186718. Hi, my name is Yong Shijia and my metric number is 186724. Uh, my name is Kashi A and my metric number is 186724. Hi, my name is Lee Shingwei and my metric number is 186537. Uh, hi, my, uh, my, 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 my metric number is 186538. So, this is our group discussion for. We have done with our BMAC 1, which is quite interesting as well. So in this video, we are going to look for any interested topic that we are going to cover for our BMAC 2. So anyone have any ideas? Any topic, we can discuss it and decide it later. We just come up with some topics. Is it can be about UPM or another thing? UPM. Yeah, like something like something considered inside UPM. I guess lah, we should. Yeah. I think it could be inside UPM or outside UPM. But if you want to do it outstation, right, it could be a little bit troublesome because you have to apply. You have to write letter like you have to apply for uh, apply with the sir and. That could be complicated. If I suggest sport, maybe if sport um, something like related to actually in UPM, right? We are normally having a lot of activity like sport. We have a lot of athletes ah, truly, truly, truly in UPM like swimmer, like runner, like. Uh, many more lah. For my information, I just know that a lot of athletes uh, and then um, maybe we can ask around maybe what type of sport they all are interested in this UPM because UPM are very so far famous in sport so maybe we can ask around which sport you like and then which entertainment or which, which activity you prefer in doing in this UPM uh, this is my opinion I think uh, like Sir has suggested that we can share some story regarding some topics right I think sport is a good topic for us to discuss la. and every one of us uh, come up with one story la, any sport that you like and the story any interesting story a sad story also can la. maybe basketball what what's what you play uh, <laughs> uh, is it bowling considered a sport? Yeah, yes. sure. Uh, I love uh, bowling. Uh, my highest score for bowling is 175. Wow. Uh, but I don't have my own bowling ball. I just use at the mall. Mm. It's quite interesting because my family, all my family members, play bowling sport. Mm. Do you learn bowling at the mall? Bowling since childhood. Uh, I learn from my uh, uh, after I'm going to school. Uh, so then my father <coughs> teach me how to play bowling. Oh, how nice! Oh. Your father bring 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 you. Ah uh, yes, yeah. my also. father bring my family. Uh, then uh, we compete each other. Compete every each time, every time after you 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 study after finish your. Um, uh, once a month. Once a month. Uh, okay. Is my my dad uh, uh tell us if we could uh reach one hundred score, uh we could get fifty tickets. Wow. Wow. Uh, wow. This is a so, positive reinforcement. Uh, so I and my uh little brother we try hard to hmm. score until we get uh. 100 score. Mm. Uh, who pay for the entry ticket? Your oh, father pay for <laughs> Because bowling is quite a costly sport, right? Uh, yes. Um, when we play, uh, we will play uh, four or five rounds. Four or five rounds. Uh, so if I can score three rounds for uh, 100 scores, 
so I can get um one of them day. and this thing gets oh. one of yeah. one time Good money one time she get um one hundred the father will give fifty then they pay for four to five rounds ma so if you score for two rounds three rounds must uh, uh, you get pocket money for the whole month already like. um 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 sometimes we play uh sometimes sometimes per per year like. Oh, not so frequent uh, since uh, it's very costly, right? Of course, right? because yes. your father like knowing her daughter or son like every time score 100, 100 then go on my money, 50, 50, 50 Then do you enjoy know. any competition? Bowling competition in UPM? Uh, no, <laughs> but I have joined uh, when I first year in UPM, I have joined the college mm. Oh, oh got win oh. Uh, did you win? Ah uh, no, uh -huh. <laughs> because uh, I'm uh, at that time I am college thirteen. Uh -huh. uh, then the other college is quite uh, That's strong. Uh, quite awesome uh, when they play. Uh, of course, uh, college sixteen, college six, six. Uh, sports college. Oh. We, yeah. yeah. Do they because they score uh, more than two hundred. Wow. Um, until uh, 250 score. Ten, oh. ten, ten times you throw the ball like ten. One round is ten times right. Full yeah. mark is ten for one time. So ten times is. Uh, if you <laughs> get, if you get strike, uh, you get uh twenty. Oh, total, twenty. Total mark, total mark for one round. Uh, I always get one hundred and one hundred seventy five. No, 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 20 times you start You don't really understand, not a boring person 20, 20, uh, multiple, 10 So maximum is 200 200 and 100 something is also very awesome For a non-boring person What, favorite sport you can? Others first lah, it's 200 Any others? The sport that I was always associated with was um, running when I was uh, since primary school. I used to always join um, short distance, 100 meter and 4 times 100. And then uh, that still goes on until my secondary and even in form 6. But then after I joined, uh, after I entered university, then I stopped running completely already because I don't have time. And then because I prioritized my sleep time more than sport. So yeah, but when I was in um, secondary school and Six, my friend and I would always join like marathons and then we would go to the stadium together and then we would just run 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 to train ourselves and then so that every time we can prepare ourselves for the actually we do not want to win the marathon but we just want to end quickly so that you know we don't be the last person in the marathon but then we always always um, go to the stadium to practice for um, Marinta Station mm. Cross Campus yeah Cross Campus Cross Campus yeah, yeah. stuff like that yeah yeah, for that one, so that um, we can aim to get, oh yeah, of course, because last time my friend and I were the team leaders for the sports team, so we have to, because you, have, you are the leader, then you have to win something out, us it's like very, very uh, embarrassing, so we always train, and then so that we can get top 10 uh, for the cross country, cross campus yeah. team, During your secondary school? Yeah, secondary school, and from 6. For me, my sport is also running, and my my running life is totally opposite with her, which is I start to engage myself in running start university. She was stopped during university, right, but I started it during my university life. <laughs> yeah, it's totally opposite. And um, I think if you want to achieve something in running this sport, right, you have to uh, spend a lot of invest a lot of time, right? So it takes off about majority of my after five time and quite an awesome memory is um my teammate and i won the group relay last time yeah 
it's quite an awesome memory for me. It's for my running life. Like. Yeah, how about others? And for me, um, I experienced a lot of sport before. Mm. I am the handball player. Um, before it, I got play basketball. I play volleyball. A lot of sport, but uh, eventually I joined the volleyball team for a long time during my form six, and also I represent the my school for the competitions of the volleyball and my uh, majorities of our competition. I win the competition. Mm. So because um. What, why I like the volleyball the most is because I don't need to run here and there. <laughs> I just uh, stand there and react fast when the ball come, coming to you. So I, I like volleyball the most. And I can feel the team spirit that I'm building. I joined the volleyball competition. And I feel proud when I win the, uh, the competition. Lah. So uh, volleyball is the best sport for me. Sorry for interrupting, but why I feel like I also play volleyball, yeah. but then why you say you can stand there? I cannot. <laughs> I always, always try to yeah, catch I, the ball. I, I don't know. I, I, I feel like uh, volleyball is just a uh, not so tired about uh, the sport uh, compared to the others. Mm. Uh, but if like basketball, right, you have to run all around. But uh, just vo- volleyball, you just like I mean, a few steps, you have to run there. Uh, so I think this is more easier for me. Uh. Maybe it be be different different team 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 but if for me to choose, I will prefer volleyball team 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 not so familiar and still now I cannot go and how to say shoot, shoot inside the the basket, the, basket. The, uh, the basket. Not, not that not that good la, but training is now training la. so maybe Lele has an idea about okay so for me actually I used to play basketball when I was in primary school until now but actually I stopped for a long period not playing basketball during my secondary school actually I started learning basketball when I was I think year 3 year 3 ah. year 3 when I was 9 years old form 3 okay form 3 form 3 form 3 year 3 year 3 primary standard 3 standard 3 when I was 10 standard 3 primary school primary school year 3 and then I stopped playing during like I stopped playing when I was in Form 3 until Form, form 6 So I start playing badminton during my Form 6 And then after that, enter the university, actually I play volleyball <laughs> Actually, I don't know, I don't really know how to play volleyball But end up, and now, I go back to like playing basketball Since I <laughs> recently I play with Cindy, Chija and Yumi So actually because like maybe basketball is the thing that I learned for so many years and then it's like it became one of my hobby already. So usually like if I got free time I will go to the basketball court and then just play for fun. Not that expert but actually like play for fun as like a sport so also for our own health as well. So for me, for me I think the sport that I play for a long time is badminton because I play since like, I was standard one or two. I play with my brother and then I go to I learn badminton with the coaches when I was in year four. And I play badminton, I represent my primary school, represent my secondary school and even my form six and then I play until now. Lah. But recently because all of my friends they went to university to different place so I stopped my badminton for a long period but in other sports like basketball and volleyball bas- I even I had played basketball and ping pong when I was in primary school also and I enjoyed them but not as much as badminton I still prefer the badminton and then the volleyball is like I play volleyball I learned volleyball I first touched a volleyball when I was in first year in PTM because my curriculum is volleyball and then and volleyball is hard at first because my hand was bruised on the first day of curriculum and then I was like I want to give up but luckily I didn't give up I just learned everything and, but 
I'm not that professional as others are, but I can serve a ball, serve a ball the, the other very hard for me. Digging, digging. Uh, digging is like a bit of digging. And like running, I also run, but very seldom also. Uh. But the, I join many sports, but the most that I like the most is still uh, badminton. Because love is the best love to you. <laughs> Yeah, how about your two shirts? Uh, for, for me, I don't know which sport I like because I can't play. I can't. I can't play the basketball, football, the ping pong, and the golf. Also, sometimes to go to the swimming. Why? Why you cannot play? Okay, not play. I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, you don't want? Yeah. Don't want. Uh, but also, I can't. I can't play mm. because sometimes I think this sport is very tight. Tired. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because I think about this time, I can go back to my home. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. So sometimes in the outside, it's very hot. Just go back to home, open my air condition. It's very cold. Is, is sport as a necessary curriculum during primary school or secondary school in China? Yeah. Uh, do you guys need to take like, um, compulsory course during your school time? Uh, in China, in my high school, uh, about math compulsory sport is running. Running. Yeah, for the one kilometers, mm-hmm. you must uh, use use the lessons time is about uh, seven minutes seven or, or six yeah. minutes. Maybe sometimes we just we are just walking. Do seven minutes walking finish. Uh, uh, for me, uh, my favorite sport is the swimming. Uh, and uh, I learned four, there is a four types of swimming, right? So I learned uh, I learned four of them, and uh, I think in my high school. Uh, but I never, uh, I never saw that there has a, a swimming pool in UK. So uh, yes, yes, and uh, I, rem- I'm, I remember the, the last video you say there is a swimming pool in UK. So. I never know, I never know. So uh, in my uh, second second year I take a uh, tennis tennis class in European and uh, I think I have no any tennis on the tennis. I think it's a very hard very hard sport and uh, every uh, yes you, you, your hand you more power maybe must be powerful and uh, so uh, <coughs> Uh, for my first uh, first time, I just play uh, half hour, and uh, I my hand is yeah, yeah very very pain very pain so yeah. Yeah. so and uh, so when I just uh, play a tennis with my friend, he just stand there and uh, uh, just shake her hand and uh, for me I I have to uh, go left uh, left to uh, from left to right and uh, go back to left from right yes I know. So I will share my sports experience. Actually, I I do not have an expert or professional like the athlete or like the others because I can enjoy the sport just to have fun and have a healthy body just like that. So if you want if you ask me to play anything so I can yeah I al- I always okay to join but I'm not very expert in sports because every year I will try a new sport. Oh. Uh, this year I will try swimming, next year I will try tennis, next year I will try ping pong. Uh, so the variety in the sport make my life Wonderful. Wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> but along this journey, what type of sport you're experiencing? Try. Mm. What type of sport? The best memory. The best memory is netball. Netball. Yeah. I would like to share one sport which is not really common in Malaysia, lah. Because I'm not joining Dragon Ball. Do you know Dragon? No. Uh, the Chinese. Chinese sport, the very very long boat and have 12 crews or 24 crews. Oh, you know Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball. I think it's hard to, hard to describe. Oh, very it's hard. a water sport which is. Where are you? Ha! Yeah, something like that. Play with the boat. And then, since it's a water sport, right, you must think that all the crew know how to swim, right? But I'm the one who don't know swimming. But I play uh, Dragon Ball. So we have a 
so called capsized blue. Capsized blue. So every time we have to wear our life jacket, then the captain will say one, two, three, then pa, everyone go into the water. Then since I cannot swim, right, I will just float there and wait my team member to, to pull me along back to the board. Yeah. I think that's the funniest moment during the drill. Like, I just want to share this spot to you guys. Um, I think that we should continue our discussion in our next video because since we are discussing our sport experience in this video, very exciting. I think everyone have an interesting experience in their sports life. So, but sadly, the topic that we should talk in the Mac 2 haven't decided yet. So, I think should we make our decision in the next video to decide which topic we should talk in the Mac? Okay, yeah. thank you. So, thank you.